Hey guys, it's Realistic Paints here, and today I am going to be showing how to draw a realistic cat in Microsoft Paint, the one and only. So, the first thing you gotta do is get the circle tool. Yeah, you get the circle, oval, same thing. And you select both colors as black or whatever color you want to actually make your cat. And then what you do is you draw the one, the oval. It's really easy. Don't worry, I'll get into more detail later. Then you click away. You make the body, but the body isn't matched up with it. So what we are going to do is move it. So that's simple. Uh, we should move it like this, so it looks better. And if there's anything like this part, like this part, you got to erase it. So, what I'm gonna do is erase it. Oops, that's weird. That's not erasing. What? What? Okay. And we gotta erase it. So, I erase that. And there, I'm zooming out, and now we have the head and the body. And then what we gotta do is make the ear. So we take the triangle tool, and make it black because I'm making a black cat, and put one ear. And then we put the second ear. It's really easy. And I'm making this longer so it kind of matches up. And again, we got to erase. Once you're done erasing, we gotta fill in the head and the ears. So, zoom out like you need to, and fill in, select both colors as black, and just simply fill all of these in. So now we got a black cat. No racism required in this. And we go for the eyes, we gotta select it. Let's make white eyes. Let's make this cat of Halloween. Because you know, it's becoming Halloween, so it's just like both colors is white. And just make both eyes, like we did last time, fill it in. If you don't know how to fill it in, you can just go back in the video. So that's that. And now we gotta make the nose. The nose, uh, I can't really draw it right now, but the nose kinda looks like this. Everyone knows that a cat's nose looks like that, but that's a crap drawing there. We gotta take the line tool, and let's make it gray. And we gotta do this. We gotta just make the line, selecting the line tool, and then we gotta select the curve tool. And how to use the curve tool? I'll just show you. You make the line, you get the middle of it, and make it go down. We're gonna do the same thing with the other one. We make the line, and make it go down. So now we have our own cat, but it's missing the nose. Cats always need noses, how would they smell? <laughs> okay, so what we're gonna do is select the pink color and just draw a line like that. And once again, we fill it in. So that is that. And what about the legs? Realistic paints? What about the legs? We're getting to that. For the legs, we need to make them very thick. Thick, oh my god. We get the size as the largest. Get the line tool. And just draw where cats would usually have legs. Draw four. If you're doing the back of his leg, make that little long. And then the next leg will be shorter. Because we've got to make it 3D-ish. So long. Shorter. See, now it looks 3D. It looks like it could be standing on a table. And we forgot about the tail. Why would we forget about that? So, get the curve tool, whatever color you want. You draw a line and make it all curvable. And we, once again, we do it again so we can make the tail thick. So kind of like do the same exact thing. I made this go up and this part go down. So, look at that. It looks really nice. But we gotta make the end of the tail, so I'm drawing a line from there to there and curving it like that. And once again, fill it in. So this is how you make your own cat. If you want to make it any color, like uh, a white cat, 
you can make it a gray cat or even a blue cat you can if you want but that's it for the video if you liked it leave a comment of what you want me to draw next for realistic tutorials in microsoft paint and i'll see all you guys later wait no that's glad smith's outro